Pump calibration is a process in which a factor that equates the number of strokes versus volume of grout is established. This is very important because one of the main components of inspection and quality control is to ensure that the minimum volumes of grout are pumped. Without having an automatic device like a flow meter, it is the only tool available to the inspectors to determine an accurate grout volume. Here is a sketch that represents the test procedure. We will use a drum or barrel. We will pump some strokes and count the number of strokes in the process. Here is a sketch that shows the dimensions we need to determine for the test. We measure the inside diameter D, the total height of the barrel H, which is measured from the inside. And at the end of the stroke, we measure the free distance between the height of the grout and the top of the barrel. Then we determine the height of grout by subtracting H sub 1 to H. We will compute the volume by multiplying the area of the circle of the diameter D times the height H2 of the cylinder of grout. The area of the circle is pi d squared divided by 4, which is multiplied by H2 to obtain the volume of grout pumped into the drum. Now this video illustrates the operation in the field. What you see right now, the inspector is taking the measurements of the dimensions of the drum. And now they're getting ready to pump some strokes into the barrel. The inspector is gonna count the number of strokes. You will notice shaking in the hose. One stroke two, three, five, and he's done. Now he's measuring the distance between the top of the barrel and the top of the ground. Now this slide shows you an example of computation of calibration factor. The inspector in this example has measured prior to stamp pumping a diameter D equals 23 inches and the total height of 34 inches. At the end of the pumping, he has counted five strokes and the clear distance between the top of ground and the top of the barrel was seven inches. Now he can determine A sub 2 equals 34 minus 7 inches equals to 27 inches. With these dimensions, he can compute the volume that was grounded. Volume equals the area of the circle times h sub 2. The area of the circle is 3.142 times 23 to the square divided by 4, which is equals to 415.5 square inches. This area multiplied by the height h sub 2 of 27 inches is 11,218.5 cubic inches. We divide this by 12 to the cube to obtain cubic feet. This gives us 649 cubic feet. This volume of 6.49 cubic feet divided by the strokes, which were 5, is 1.3 cubic feet per stroke. This is the calibration the inspector will use in the calculation of volumes during the installation of the production auger cast piles. And this is the end of this pump calibration video. Thank you.